and it seems like how and it seems like I'm what am I going to do that scarf video man scarf video you retard YouTuber I'm a horrible YouTuber it seems like the with the absence of Hamza the sound proof giant Seems like those little guys are getting more room and traction to grow. Come on, come on. I think Hamza has changed the lives of so many. And Hamza is such a positive force within the Sun community. And, and honestly, I quite like it when he's up on his ego and he's like, oh, yeah, I am better than other men. I am like almost aggressive like lack when he lacks humility. He's not humble. Everyone likes guys of, to, of a higher stature earning a, a certain income and being in better shape and all the things to be humble. Be humble. When well, they don't really need to be humble because they are literally better than the majority of people around them. Anyways. Like, it's difficult to be humble when you're just around shitheads that are lazy all the time. Like, how do people not have the energy to exercise? Today, I didn't really feel like going boxing. I didn't like boxing. <laughs> I didn't want to go. I was fucking tired. I'm like, oh, if, if I eat McDonald's like I am now, I'll feel sluggish when I when I go. The fuck? What the fuck? What type of logic is that? What earth type of logic is that? And oh, so stupid. So stupid. I went anyway because I just had to dispel. My lack of discipline, my lack of motivation. I had to dispel my lack of motivation with dis with discipline, and it's just it's just fucking it's so weird. It is so weird for me to just sit there and just not want to go, not to have the energy to exercise. I don't understand how people not have the energy to exercise. I don't understand. I I had a moment in period in time where I did not exercise. I un understand that that moment because I just didn't know about exercising. The moment I knew about exercising, I took it seriously. Genuinely. There is nothing, there's, no, there's nothing higher ROI than trying to develop the real estate that you have right here. And trying to get as much muscle as you can, to get as big as you can, strong as you can, fit as you can. There's nothing more higher ROI than that. If you think otherwise, you're stupid. You live in this body. Why isn't this body in the best shape it could possibly be in? What's going on? Why why are you skimping out on your push-ups? Just push-ups. Oh, but my arm's really tired, my arm's sore from the other day, and I'm tired and my joints are weak and my joints are blown. Like that's I joints are blown. I literally heard that from guys in the gym when I was still going. I didn't do squats. Oh, because my joints hurt and they blasted and my knees are bad and I've done it. Excuse. Excuse. Why are you making those excuses when they don't benefit anyone, not even yourself? When you train, like, when I, I tell people to train, I don't, that doesn't benefit me. How does that benefit me? That's your body, not mine. It's purely selfless. The act of me telling you and motivating you to be trained is purely selfless. Okay, guys? Got the original point. Bah.